Good afternoon. This is Pastor Bryson Assurance Baptist Church. This afternoon, a special uh, type of thoughts for Thursday. Psalm 107 says, Give thanks unto the Lord, for he is good, for his mercy endureth forever. Let the redeemed of the Lord say so, whom he hath redeemed from the hand of the enemy. And gather them out of the lands from the east and from the west and from the north and from the south. I am challenging everyone to share this video, to share in the comment section what you're thankful for, not only in November, but all the time. Give thanks unto the Lord. Let's make this thing go viral. Let's share it all over the world that people can give thanks and praise publicly to Jesus. If we are ashamed to give praise publicly to Jesus, he'll be ashamed before his Father in heaven. Let's blast this all over, get rid of all the political garbage, all the other stuff that's going on, and let's let the redeemed of the Lord, I'm counting on you Christians, to share this, to repost it, whatever you do on Facebook, uh, to make this go viral, but also in the comment section to say what you're thankful for this afternoon and going into the evening when you get home from work. I challenge everyone to share this, to like this, to do whatever you can. If you've not liked the Assurance Baptist Church Facebook page, I'm asking you to like that as well. We want to see uh, the likes for that get to a thousand by the end of the year. We've got work to do there. But when you like and share, it allows other people to see our content, even our live streams, which we are working fervently uh, to update and get a new camera and to be able to uh, do those live streams in a better fashion and, and here in our church. Uh, even having some TVs put in throughout some of the classrooms for social distancing rooms and also being able to use those for overflow. And so let the redeemed of the Lord say so. If you are saved, you've been redeemed from the depths of hell and from the stain of sin, and you've been redeemed by the blood of the Lamb, then you should say so today. Let's use every single avenue and opportunity we have to glorify the name of Jesus Christ, to give him thanks for the things that he has done. And that's what we're looking to do with this challenge. So I challenge you to share this, to like this, to comment, and to make sure that everybody around us knows the name of Jesus.